all right guys so welcome back to another video so today i have a brand new pack of pro b1s and i have pro b1s lake ball so this is the one that you can buy online through ebay or any through amazon as well you can pay uh like half price or sometimes even less than half price this is the uh double a quality so it's supposed to be pretty good uh, what i'm gonna do today i'm just gonna test them and see if i see any difference in uh maybe if there's any difference in distance in sound or feel so stay tuned for the video all right so this is the pro b1x brand new pack and the way we're gonna um tell them apart is that obviously it's probably one x and is one and this one is the lake balls and the quality of it uh not sure i think they were you know they were treated refurnished so um i'm just gonna see if there is any difference in feel i can already tell you that this feels a little more glossy than this one right here but maybe it's just you know maybe it's just in my head so uh, let's try them out well, I'm going to start with the Pro B1X, brand new Pro B1X. Pretty good a little bit to the right the feel i would say just like a standard pro b1 so let's get the other ball now all right so now i'm gonna try the pro b1 tireless lake ball This one's probably hit a little better. Straight. Let's check out the distance. All right, so we're gonna see the two balls. Uh, I have to be honest, the first one, it faded. So I didn't hit it completely well. It felt pretty good though. I can feel that it was uh, very well compressed. I just lost it a little bit to the right. And then the second one, that one I hit really, really well. And, but the feel, I'm not sure. It didn't feel as good as the first one, even though I hit it flush but maybe that's just in my head so we're, we're gonna see the distance first all right so i'm getting close to the balls right here remember this one right here that i faded was the pro b1 brand new pro b1x okay and in theory this one should have gone a little less in my opinion but it's right here and the other one i can give you the, yeah just from this angle you can see better so this is the Pro B1X, brand new for a box. And then the leg ball is right there. Right there. So I would say that's about probably like 10 yards maybe, 10 yards more. But I would say that this right here was hit much better. So I, I would imagine that this one should have gone just a little farther in my opinion. So the Pro B1 is right here, just to get a perspective here. And the other one, in line with that, it will be exactly right here. So, let's see, right there. So it will be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. About 30 steps is about like barely 10 yards, I would say. But the thing is that I didn't hit the first shot well. It, it faded a little bit on me. It felt good. And the second one, I, I felt like I hit it better but it didn't feel good. So I'm not sure if maybe there's something with the ball that it loses a little distance, I would say. Okay, guys, I have to show you something on this ball. Look at this leg ball. And you can see that like part of the covering came off right there. So maybe that's why it didn't feel as good. Not sure if that's the, the reason why, but definitely this is the leg ball. And this is the new ball. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, hit to the green right here. 
All right, so I have 146 yards to the pin from here. Uh, what's gonna happen is like, I'm gonna close my eyes and then Matthew is just gonna put the balls random on the ground. And I'm just gonna, he's gonna put it with the logo, obviously on the ground so I can't see it. Uh, I'm just gonna hit them, 146. I'm gonna use a nine iron. Um, and then we're gonna see what happens. All right, so 146, I don't know which one is which. I'm just gonna hit them. I got my nine iron. I'm gonna try to carry 140. Okay, this one went a little right, but it should be on the green. Now I'm gonna hit the next one. I'm gonna clean the club real quick. Try to get this in line. Hit this a little heavy. And it stay a little short, but I did hit it a little heavy though. Let's go see. Okay, so obviously it's gonna be hard to, you know, I can't, I'm not a robot. I can hit every shot the same. Uh, on this one, I hit the first one better than the second one. And uh, the second one, uh, it was a little heavy. I think it's just right on the fringe before the green. So it's just to get an idea of the distance, obviously, and try to help you decide whether uh, leg balls are good or, you know, if they're worth it or not, so. Okay, so this one that I hit heavy, it was the second one. It kind of bounced right here and I went into the fringe. And this one is the Pro B1X. And this is the leg ball pitch mark right here. And uh, it went to the right, but this one, this ball right here, I did hit it pretty good though. So um, I don't know if that changes anything. It does show that uh, part of the covering came off though. When you get the leg balls, uh, these are Pro B1's leg balls refurnished. You have to be careful because if you look, there's some that are better quality than others. Notice the, uh, the number in there. And some are like black, some are um, red. And then you can see that there's different qualities. Like look at this. You can see the covering is a little all on this one. And then this one right here looks pretty neat, pretty new. So you just have to be careful in which one you're uh, you're using. But uh, like this one right here is, I think this is pretty new. I mean, this is pretty good. It looks brand new, except for just right here. You see a little scuff right there on the side. So so just look around and see which ones are better than the other ones. This one is looks a little older. So just have a look around. Hey guys so that was it for the video i did uh test it around the greens as well i did some putting some uh, chips and i hit all the iron shots um it's really hard to tell the difference the only shot that i would say that i felt like it should have been longer was on the the one that you saw on that driver that was the only one but so for me i think they're uh, yeah they could be worth it uh depends though because a lot of times in the same box you see some balls that are better quality than others. So uh, the one that I picked, I think it was one of those that wasn't probably the best of the quality. So from, from the bunch, from the box that you get when you get the uh, leg balls, uh, you just have to be careful to pick some some of the balls there that are better quality. So they're not all the same quality, I would say. Uh, but overall, I guess, you know, it's not, a, you're paying half price. So it could be a good thing depending on where you're playing. You know, if you're playing a very important tournament, maybe I would just stick to the regular probably once. But if you're doing a practice round, definitely the, the leg balls are fine. So, guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. Until next time.